Hello, viewers. A very good morning, and welcome to Africa and Beyond Television Network. And this morning, let us talk about important matters. Sevia Kasukwe, former Minister of Local Government in the nation of Zimbabwe, as well as former political commissar of Zanu PF Party, uh, he said something very important, and he slammed the President Emerson Dambuzo Munangagwa's administration, accusing them of inhuman treatment of the so-called. Uh, illegal settlers. He said the concern we have is the current alarming destruction of homes and livelihoods across the country. The country's economic situation is already difficult for the majority of our people. People are barely able to have three meals a day. And to make matters worse, homes are now being destroyed. This is a cause of concern. I can tell you, just imagine that the economy prices are actually going up fees, everything else, people are struggling to make and meet uh, or to, to, to put food on the table. But destruction of homes is actually following them across Zimbabwe. He says this is a serious cause of concern because after burning and destroying the homes uh, which are sheltering children, how are they going to survive? So the major important aspect in terms of everything else is the children. The children are owned by the High Court of the Republic of Zimbabwe, that is according to the law, which means before you destroy these homes where children are staying, you must go to the High Court, seek an eviction order so that you can carry on with that eviction. So they didn't do that. They don't even have court orders permitting them to do these evictions, but they are going forward with them. And right now they are using a new tactic where they come and arrest you using non-existent laws. They come and arrest you, they put you in a magistrate court, that is the tactic they are using, which means that is illegal. What is happening is legal. Sergei Vakasukwere says, I believes that um, there is a fifth columnist which have taken over the control of the process. Does it mean that Mabuna Zoka Mabunu are in charge? Remember, we were being told that opposition is not going to survive. Who are wrong? Who is doing that? So you see that um, it's something else. One of the key important issues um, he said the Uchena land report would have been acceptable response if the recommendations were being considered. Alas, you can't because some of the culprits are high-ranking bureaucrats who store land and dubiously change its ownership. And it's happening. The mayor of Arari spoke about adjacent rural districts engaging in illegal sale of land without appropriate infrastructure is instructed. This matter should be attended to ASAP. So the major question is, who is behind all which is happening in the nation of Zimbabwe. You can say, Mr. Government, stop this one don't senseless destruction of people's livelihoods. You can correct the situation and still minimize the pain. And I agree with Sevia Kasukwere because, guys, Paka Garamunu for 24 years, Ungo Ya Ungo Kanyiru, you are no, you are illegally settling here. My body could be called me, say me for the past 24 years, Daka Garasuriba Mtemu. Were you not part of the crime which was committed? Because the law says you go on a Moshe Chitika, and if you cover Moshe Yoyo, you are part of the of the problem, and you are also a criminal. It is what it is in Zimbabwe, and um, we will continue to take a look and talk much about what is happening in the nation of Zimbabwe. It's not a good situation, um, but those repo Let us meet in other episodes as well as other broadcasts.